because of a heartbreak that, that went on. So the present being two of cups, eight of wands in reverse and the judgment. Okay, so this gives me the energy. Hi everyone, welcome back to my life tarot. Where I use tarot to pull energies to see what we can learn from a situation. I use people in the public eye because I feel like in, we know these people, well, not know them, but we can uh, see the stories play out for the most part. So this is not negative gossip, it's not meant to be that at all. If you're looking for that, there are other channels <laughs> that I'm sure will be wonderful for you. But this is about being introspective, growth and healing. So today's topic um, is Taylor Swift and Carly Kloss, their friendship. I haven't really seen Carly Kloss in a while. When I was used to model, I used to be like, inspired by other models so she was very inspirational to me at that time but i'm not biased i come from a clean slate and yeah so just putting that out there so with the chart sun in sagittarius for taylor swift her moon is in cancer and her rising is in scorpio now carly class her sun is in leo her libra her moon is in libra and her rising is in cancer wow interesting so i just want to put it out there if you are interested in requesting a video like this video was requested check um, write in the comment section the video you'd like to see and that you're a subscriber. I only take videos from subscribers. Please make sure you're subscribed and um, yeah, like the video too, please. So, I pulled up the past, the present, and the future. In the past, I get two of ones, three of ones in reverse, and three of swords. Okay, so I get like a kind of sisterly friendship. Um, I get that one of them, I think it was Taylor, I don't really know too much about the story, but what I'm picking up here is that one of them, I think it was Taylor, was going through a very difficult time in her life and um, they found solace in one another because of that, because of a heartbreak that, that went on. So the present being two of cups, eight of wands in reverse and the judgment, okay so this gives me the energy that they probably still talk every now and then not as much i feel like one of them is busy so i don't know this about kali class but i think she might have kids i just picked that up right now i think she might have kids and that is what is stopping them from um being friends you know i have friends i have kids it does kind of change the friendship um it does change the friendship it's not anything bad it just changes the friendship and you have to really like step out of yourself for the people that don't have kids you have to really see that it's not personal if they don't want to hang out with you anymore they just have kids and their lives have changed so with the future being ace of swords and the wheel and the chariot i had to tell myself that recently actually too with ace of swords the wheel and the chariot so i do feel like they're going to be friends again i don't think there was a major fallout and i just feel like they had distance between them some of them even with the bottom of the deck with them i feel like there was physical distance between them at some point i feel like because both of them traveled and stuff like that i think carly might live in europe i don't think she lives in america if she does she lives far away from um taylor so with the wheel of fortune the star six of pentacles i feel as though Taylor's very focused on her money right now. You know, her new song just came out. Her new album is about to drop. The Magician and Starseed being four card in this deck. They uh, kind of are like, okay, let's let's meet up, let's meet up, let's meet up. And then something happens. So I feel like Taylor, Taylor thinks Carly is flaking on her. But she's not. She just has a lot on her plate, especially if she has kids. I strongly feel like she has kids, but if she doesn't, she has something. She has a major family priority that she has to um, adhere to. So it has nothing to do with with Taylor, but t I feel like Taylor, Taylor thinks it does. Okay, so with Knight of Cups, Ten of Swords, and the Moon. Well, wow. okay, so there's going to be um, secret thoughts. Okay, so this is the thing. I feel like Taylor is going to build this up in her head that Carly doesn't want anything to do with her and that kind of stuff. And she's going to build it up in her head so much that she's going to think the worst when it's really 
not the case she's gonna be like well this and that and this and that and she might even confront carly and say that and she's like i have no idea what you're talking about i'm just really really busy so with the temperance and king of cups it's going to take one of them to be mature enough to say to clear the air because i feel like there's a lot of like stagnant energy um and neither of them are taking the initiative to be honest with each other and say okay i'm really busy or taylor says okay i feel like you don't like me anymore as a friend that kind of energy is very stagnant so i pulled the card for healing and it says i claim my desires i hold great visions i am ready to receive so what a great video i mean <laughs> video what a great uh card to get i feel like that is very true you know if they want this friendship to last claim it speak to each other and really hold friendship friendship is so important to me i feel like sometimes we forget about our friends i'm guilty of that too forget about our friends and if you have a child especially i feel like she has a newborn i just get that energy it's totally understandable it's going to happen but just remind your friend that's why so i love you all please comment in the comment section i'd love to hear what you have to think have you had a friend that you felt like was distanced towards you um and if so did you let them know um yeah so Take care.